oh no, I'm out of eggs. What am I going to do? Uh, am I going to go to the 7-Eleven and pay six bucks for a dozen eggs that are, you know, from the factory farms and all that? Um, no. Um, so, looking, looking around, what do I see? I've got some recipes. Looks like I've got quick mix whole wheat pancakes. Two cups whole wheat flour, two, te two teaspoons baking powder, one teaspoon salt, two eggs. Uh, uh oh, we're out of bit. We're out of eggs, or am I? Look at this. I've got powdered eggs in my survival stores. Uh, just a little bit over a tablespoon of uh, egg powder, and just mix it up with a little bit of water, and you've got uh, you've got eggs. I just basically threw that in with all the dry ingredients. The uh, the powdered eggs and just added a little bit more water. Uh, two cups of milk. I use the uh, survival milk because I am out of milk. I should do grocery shopping more often. Anyway, uh, two tablespoons of vegetable oil. Oh, I got that covered. Okay. Mixed it all up in a uh, little bowl and uh, then I thought I'd fire up my camp stove. Oh, look at that. Looks like it's ready. Yeah, threw that with the others in, in there. It's always a good idea to practice with this stuff. And boy, this stuff, this stove, it really kicks. I mean, I'm used to cooking with electric, uh, an electric stove, and I can understand where the expression "cooking with gas" comes from. The pan just heats up almost instantly, and started smoking, and I had to run after it and pull the thing off the fire. Generally, you could. Takes, takes a pan on the electric stove a few minutes to warm up. Well, uh, so basically if you have survival goods, the coolest thing is you don't really have to scramble if you forget to get something at the grocery store. You can grab things out of your survival goods and make a good breakfast and continue with your morning routine and do your grocery shopping later. You gotta love that.